All right, a couple people were asking how to set up the Timo Link uh, Godox receiver to the Citus Link Pro. I'm gonna show you how to set it up with the F22C, which I have, which is Bluetooth, but you're also able to plug that receiver in to make it uh, Timo Link compatible to work with DMX and addressing on Citus Link Pro. So let's get started. All right, so once you get your project loaded up, you're gonna wanna come up here to the networking options. And make sure you're connected to your device, your transmitter. Now, my transmitter is not the Godox one. I have an Aurora Lumen Radio, but um, if you're using both the Godox transmitter and receiver, then it would either show up here on network or your CRMX um, Bluetooth um, section as well. So make sure you're connected to that. Then all you're going to want to do is click the plus up here, the top right. You're going to want to add new fixtures. Now it's already scanned. Um, I'm using an Ameren F22, which has built-in Bluetooth. So it's already picked that up, but I don't want to use the Bluetooth because I won't be able to do any of the DMX addressing um, in, the, in the patching bay that way. So I'm going to actually manually set this up so it goes through um, non-Bluetooth. I'm going to go to Aperture, Ameren is my F22. I'm on mode three, CCT and HSI, and then I'm going to hit next. And there comes up the patch panel. And now mine's already patched into uh, fixture address 131, so I'm just going to change it to that. Or well, you would set your unit to the same um, number you want to patch it in on your patch bay. You can also change some of the parameters here if you want to, uh, and the naming as well. So I'm going to confirm that. It's going to save it. There it is at the bottom there. Uh, in the bottom there. So now it says DMX instead of Citus Bluetooth, which is what I want. I'm going to hit save. Now it's brought it in. I have my fixture right here. It's in a group as well as just the fixture by itself. So I can just start to bring this up here and it's working on my end. So the big things to remember, make sure your address is set the same as to what you put on the um, app itself. Make sure your Godox receiver is receiving CRMX. It'll light up here with either one to three bars. If it's blinking, then it's not um, set up and you're gonna wanna hit the reset button on the back on both the receiver and the transmitter to get them to sync up. Now I don't have the Godox transmitter itself, I just have the receiver, but you can use any uh, transmitter as long as it has uh, Lumen Radio CRMX uh, transmitting it. So again, if you guys enjoyed the video, please give me a like, subscribe, it really helps me out. We'll see you next week.